Uh, accept Sigun Xro is uh, my friend also. Oh, thank you. Um, Ingram? Yes? No nafta pots. <laughs> uh, we have nafta pots, but not enough time to, to get them in the right position right now. That castle was not that, that good Damn prepared it. in the beginning. Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. I could also uh, some. Check the loot. What about the loot cart? Did we not... Uh... Maybe I'm checking, but I don't see any. Yeah. That's a go. Guys, I've posted, I've posted the video of the battle. Thank you very much. Alright, now is not probably a good time to watch the video. Now you can go watch <laughs> Two monitors, that's how you play Life is Feudal. Exactly. I think there's no one without a second screen, huh, playing that game. <laughs> I only have one screen, I've been put a second screen, it's been torture. Yeah, same procedure, infantry rally up at flag, we make units and then prepare to push forward. Where the fuck is blue? There's uh, blue. I'm looking for it. Same map. Is it? Yeah. 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 <clears throat> sure. Yeah, mm -hmm. so it's a fixed map on this base, oh. so you will always have the same unless they drop double links to us by the long What else is easy? Are we doing the same position? Once you are in a unit, you can move slightly away. Alright guys, here, here's the game plan, alright? Ooh, we do not have as many cavalry. Or right, actually something we just mount up. Okay. Infantry, same exact plan, same exact position. We rush that ridge, we set up defenses, we start shooting down into them, okay? If they push, we smash them, okay? We have the number advantage, it works perfectly in our favor. Our cavalry will push very early on. If they try to push towards that ridge, the cavalry will push them back. But the cavalry will not get dragged into a, you know, fucking clusterfuck. Okay? So cavalry is purely, you know, if you're infantry and you see 20 cavalry running towards you, you're not going to run towards them. At least, I hope these guys won't. <laughs> won't work well for them. All right? So, their infantry should back off, and then I just want I want them to lead their enemy cavalry towards us. All right? Have, if you have any anti-cav people, keep them on the left flank. Anti-cav characters on the left flank. Uh, by the way, uh, I'm not sure if characters mentioned it, but enemies apparently using poison. All right? Uh, a lot of them, so keep an eye open for that. Uh, did I miss anything important? Don't think so. Sounds good. And do any of you guys have medium warfare kits or not? Good answer. Negative. So that's enough. <laughs> All right. Well, then we've got like five medium warfare kits. So the plan is to attack. All right. And uh, I'd appreciate if you can inform all your men, do not judge my tier 1 armor, okay? If this fucker keeps laughing at me, it's gonna piss me off. <laughs> 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 it was the best I could find at short notice. They'll tremble before your superior movement speed. Wait, what is your character name?
I have to admit, never have I felt so absolutely fucking useless on a battlefield than with this build. But I couldn't bring over my main PvP here. Thirty seconds. Just so that way you guys can inform your cavalry, do not have them overcommit, okay? They might try to do something different, but I don't know. If they follow up with the same exact plan that we're doing, well, we know the outcome, alright? Get ready to push. Move out. Who the fuck brings a fucking regular horse into an instance battle? <laughs> was, was seeing that as well, but that guy mm, had the, the normal it. horse also in the last battle, so he, it seems he, like he has a good plan. Oh my god. The regular idiots. horse uh, protects him from arrows. Oh. He's an archer. He hides oh. behind it. Yeah, if you use it like and that, not bad. I looted that horse, so it's not mine. Alright. We used to do that in close battle. Hey, yeah, we left. just go up to the ridge line if we have high ground. There and we'll be more on the tree line to our left. Infantry, what? The, well, yeah, infantry. Need cavalry left. in the left side. Anti cav infantry also get ready with anti cav weapons in case. We take the hill. Some of the cavalry is engaging. Yeah, our cavalry is going to engage, so watch your flanks. Move, move they'll up, see these up. two or three infantry up top and they'll think the rest of us are here. I'm guessing they're pushing. No, I should rebring myself a horse. Yeah, Archer's crossbow guys keep fire on enemy lancers coming close to infantry. Set up the defensive fences. They're down below the ridge. Alright, this is going to be a walking apart, guys. Yeah. Hold the high ground, set up your defensive positions. Archers... All archers, unless you're placing defenses, rain downhill. Infantry stays back. Don't shoot for that guy. Shoot for yeah, the do not, guys. Do not shoot the guy close to us. Watch uh, fires, you're shooting our own cavalry right now. Some yeah, of the every archers. single arrow should be focused on those infantry in front of us. Alright. Don't shoot into the Lancer fight. Shoot on enemy infantry, not on the Lancers. Yeah. Uh, Calix, check yes. our rear. Yeah, I'm on There's it. There's no way that's all of them. They've separated their forces. This is a, a whole different shit that I've never even seen before. Uh, DVD, uh, Ashenfall used to do that early game. Uh, split their forces a lot and tried to make Pancake happen. Uh, I don't think they put that much thought into it. Listen up, those guys in the open are really easy targets for archers, so just keep on hitting them. We must be smashing them to pieces. Listen up, all the cavalry, reel them back towards ours. Alright, reel them back. We have the high ground, there's no need to overcommit right now. Bring all the cavalry back. Alright, we just we just lost uh, one or two dismounted up front, so watch out. Focus on that pikeman in front of you guys, if, you, if you're able to. How's everyone's cavalry components doing? Going well. Listen up, we have got serious range capabilities now, so let's use it, alright? Uh, 
I still see a lot of blue lancers down there. Um, listen up, guys. Bring back your lancers, right? All the Templar lancers are falling back, and they're with our main force now. If anyone's lancers are still engaged, they're doing it so outnumbered, which takes away the advantage from us. So either I have to send in the cavalry again, or I gotta wait for you guys to come out. Bring right. your cavalry priests out. We're just shooting all the shit out of them. Watch your fire, please. No enemy fire. Uh, no friendly fire, sir. Alright. Uh, listen up, guys. How do you guys feel about an advance? We do have other instance battles. These guys could just be trying to drag out time. Yes? No? Sure. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Stop your shooting. Everyone forward. Have the cavalry go in, try to circle around, go clockwise, pick off their archers mainly. All infantry will go in now. Alright, yeah, these guys are getting fucking ruined. Uh, range people, you, you know, switch to your melee if you need to or donate and over engage. Archers, hold your fire. Some of you guys watch your flanks, there could be some horsemen still alive. There's no way this is all of them. Everyone rally up, rally up all your trips back to the totem, back to the totem. Calyx, rally up everything, yeah. All force to back to the totem. Uh, have your cavalry screen the infantry just in case. One or two, sure, go ahead, but everyone else should screen. Totes and clear. Uh, there's a couple of them, I think, down in the below us. <laughs> well, Vanguard I, I on the right guys, for guys. us on our right side, they're enemies. It if seems, you want, you can chase uh, them. It seems that this plan wasn't so perfect. I didn't get the infantry to get more blood in their hands. It was just mainly archers and cavalry. I apologize for the sword and borders. <laughs> Do not surround the totem to loot it. Surround the totem to defend it. There are still enemies left alive, there's no way we killed them all, unless some, a lot of them fled. Alright, so face outwards, there could still be more. Uh, keep all cavalry away, alright, for right now. Do you, does anyone here have contact still? I can't see any of them. Just check inside the trees if you're scouting on the whole thing. We have scouts. inside the tree. We have already scouts out. Templar lancers going around. Check the perimeter. I don't think we have anything else. There's nothing to worry about right now, but no Better point safe taking than any unnecessary risks. Yeah. We just one guy left just to make start time. There's no way that was all of them though. Unless our cavalry um, is absolutely the, These obliterated. guys, they only enter if they think they're going to win. So when they lost the first battle, probably a lot of them were still enlisted. I went, nah, I'll go into second battle. That's the kind of players that these guys are. They're not disciplined or anything like that. <laughs> oh yeah, no more fancy jewelry, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. 
Thanks again, guys. We really appreciate your help in that instance battles. It's a lot of fun to fight with you guys together. It's really disciplined. I like that. Yeah. Likewise. To be, to, to be honest, what I'm seeing here is better than some of the, the discipline I've seen on Avalon. Yeah. So, can totally fun. agree that. A lot, a lot of people here responding a lot quicker. Good find. I have to admit, very fine work from all the archer contingents as well. Yep. Cavalry are doing nicely in their fight, but the archers as well. Also, there was easy. just one time there came the, the intel that we have some friendly fire, so that's yeah. okay. You, yeah, you yeah. cannot totally avoid it completely, but. It always happens. Yeah. Really good work. Uh, after today, I guess, or after the next two instance battles, for anyone who are permanently on Epiland, I think I've heard. Uh, the guild JK. I don't know how to pronounce yeah, the name. Yeah, Joy. Yeah. So, um, after today, I wouldn't mind, uh, well, before today, I pretty much, uh, ignored everything on Epiland and only focused on Avalon. But I wouldn't mind sitting down for a little bit, getting a bit more information on the, the, the dealings of uh, Epiland. If I have to come over and deal with this more often, then, uh, I like to have better information. I yeah, do know sure, TVG no just switched, so. Again, we're. Uh, Templars are very caught up with our business on Avalon. We're in like we're fine on three different servers on Avalon right now. So yeah, for I, anything if I could else, close up some of the fighting. I'd happily come along and sort some. Stuff. I will have a permanent character on Epilan, So if anything is you you need help, whatever, just message me on Discord. It's Kovlix. Oh, oh yeah, and if uh, if we ain't got anything lined up on uh, off Judgment Hour days, if you guys ever need help, we'll, we'll see if we can send people over. On the Right, Congrats. Free loot, guys. Loot. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No T3 padded set for me this time. I got an empty bottle. I got an empty <laughs> bottle. <laughs> That's all I grabbed, an empty bottle. I don't even try to loot, to be honest. Oh, man. There's no, there's no point. All right, guys. Well, see you in the next round battle. three coming up. An empty fucking bottle. Yeah, that's what I deserve. 